Oh, yeah, here as uh, Azimio women, all the 26 parties that are in Azimio today, we decided to meet their uh, women league um, uh, chairs. And of course, I'm here with the chair of the women league of ODM, the Tiengo. And in that room, we have secretary generals or women league uh, chairs of their leagues. And one of the reasons that we're here today, apart from many others, which is of course our plan to go to the ground, is as simple as this Martha Karua. Deputy President Azimio. We do not know why it's rocket science. We do not see how you cannot see the value of Martha. And one of the values of Martha is, of course, she's a national figure. She has vied for presidency. Martha has been a minister. She knows how to run government. And Martha's record speaks for itself. She's a committed woman. She's known for integrity. And she's known for her resoluteness. And we think that she would add not only to Azimio but to this country as a deputy president. So really that is what the main focus of our meeting today and how we will start lobbying because everything for women is lobbying, everything for positions is lobbying. We are going to start that serious conversation within Azimio that we think that the number two for Azimio, for Raila Amolo Odinga, should be Martha Karua. Everywhere in politics there is negotiation and talks. I have been in talks many times before even when we were forming GPD. I know these talks, how they happen. I We know how negotiations are done and what we are saying is that we are now also in the negotiation space for Mata Karua. Irrespective of which political party we come from, we are coming as the women's movement believing that Mata Karua will add not only to the value as I said of the presidency of Raila Odinga but at last to give women of Kenya that hope to see that they can be leaders at the level of a deputy president. So the rest of the uh, names that are lobbying around Azimio. We wish them well, but we think our strategy may be the winning one. Before we do that, we need to come up with the engagement with the women of Kenya.